Uh, you had your first league start against New Mexico. What were your overall feelings when that announcement was made that you will be starting that game? Of course, I was really excited. Um, unfortunately for me, I didn't play so much yet. Um, so I know it was a big chance for me. Um, and then, yeah, of course, the game went my way. Um, we won. I think I had a few saves. So it was a good first game for me. And what kind of challenges, kind of just how you mentioned you hadn't had much playing time, what kind of challenges, if any, did you face going into a match like this without playing? Yeah, match? of course, it's a little bit difficult if you don't have the, exper uh, the every week to week games um, to get a little bit used to the back line, to crosses, to kind of get a feeling of our game. But I mean, I'm kind of experienced now a little bit, so it's not a big problem for me anymore to adjust um, and just try to play my game and it worked pretty well. How about the weather, Patrick? How have you been adapting to that? Here or in New Mexico? Here. Here? I mean, I'm a little bit used to it. My wife is from here, so I came here a lot of times. Um, so I knew the weather, of course. Now it's getting a little bit hot. Um, but yeah, we're dealing with it. Playing against a team in Memphis that hasn't lost very much at all as of late. So what has the coaching staff really been emphasizing with you guys trying to get the best result possible? Yeah, I mean, they're a good team. Of course, they are, I think, third. Um, but uh, we also saw some weaknesses, so I think it's actually a team who will, what will work our way. Uh, I feel like these teams who, are, who maybe start to attack a little bit more better than just someone who sits back. Um, so I feel like we have a good chance to win this game. And for your own perspective, what's kind of your main goal going forward with this next match? Well, um, for me, just to, to give the best support to Rocco. Um, and then, uh, again, I'm ready if they need me and if that day or the chance ever comes, I'm ready to play. Explain the process of going through a season and maybe not necessarily knowing when you're going to get to play next as a goalkeeper. Well, I mean, as a goalie, it's always like you, you play or you don't play. I knew that, Rocco knew that. Um, unfortunately for me, I'm not playing as much, but um, trying to help Rocco as much as possible in a game is my experience. And then, of course, in every train, I try to beat him and show the, the coach that uh, I'm ready to play. As a, a more experienced professional, um, what's your relationship with Rocco been like so far this year, trying to mentor him, but also compete with him and try and push him? Um, I tried to look back when I was kind of in this situation, 17, 18, 19. Um, I was not playing at that time, really, but I knew how important it is to have maybe someone older who maybe went through certain situations, maybe I see games different, to give him maybe some advice how I see it. Doesn't mean that that's right or wrong, but just give him another opinion. If he takes it on, that's on him. But I try to be really supportive because at the end of the game, we're a team sport, it's not indi individual. It's good for me if we win. It's nothing good for me if I tell him, dive right, ball goes left and we lose. So I try to do the best for the team. But of course, I said before, in every training, I try to beat him to show the coach that I'm ready. So, yeah.